Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing and full review of this DPO Niagara smartwatch. The big thing here is that we have a 1.69 inches 43 millimeter uh, full touch screen fitness watch here that's uh, really large. Uh, we have IP68 waterproof protection which is good but of course it's not for swimming but still it seems to have a lot of function a lot of tracking and also it has a very long battery life here we see some of the information but let's open see what we get and how this works so here's the watch in the packaging looks really good I would say has a decent size looks pretty good it comes with this magnetic charge you can see it has nice hold here I recommend to use a good power source not just a power bank otherwise it could be not enough power we can see it has turned on automatically and then of course we have to download the app we find the QR code here in the instructions manual and this brings us here to the official Android Play Store, which is a good thing. So we don't have to download from a third-party website. I've already set up an account here in the app. Now let's try to connect the device. We click here on connect the device. We choose the Niagara. So let's turn it on, see if there is something. Maybe let's go to the settings. Okay, it has already found it. We click here to link. So that was super easy. And then we get also a very important warning. That's really important to do the proper settings that you give the right authorizations. Otherwise, this watch won't work properly, but same with every smartwatch. So I've been wearing the watch for a little bit and I can confirm that it's very comfortable, really nice, uh, especially this watch band works really good. And I would say it has a decent length as well, even for uh, thicker or larger wrists. It comes with these two straps here to secure it nicely. Yeah, really comfortable thing here. Then we have a lot of information directly on the watch. When we pull down, we have a lot of settings like the torch, day and night, do not disturb, a lot of different things already. Uh, a stopwatch here, which is also very nice. Then we have some weather information and then we can adjust the brightness from very low to pretty high so you can see this display is really good and we have all the settings here and when we go to the left side we have also the weather information and uh, that's always good here to have in almost every function we have more information i mean we have the thing which we want let's say the blood oxygen we can click on that and do the measurement uh, but we can also see the details here last seven data last seven readings we go to left side same thing for the heart rate also with a lot of information already on the watch here that's really good also for the sleep tracking a lot of things here already on the watch also for the steps this is much more than what i've seen from other watches really nice and when we scroll down we get all the message notification so everything works really nice we have a really nice beautiful screen scrolling works really nice as good as it gets with such a watch and when we click here we get a lot of more possibilities we have these steps again training which we can start recording eight different things measure heart rate blood oxygen sleep again we already had this weather we had then a breathe training then remote control for the camera then the alarm we have only three possible alarms but uh, the good thing is we can see that here the details i mean we can't change that but we can activate and deactivate the alarms directly here on the watch it's a huge advantage then we have a timer let's say for one minute we start it here then we can go back into the main menu and invoke the timer again you can see it has been running in the background really nice that's also a rare function stopwatch here again music control and the settings so you can see we have a lot of functions really nice thing already here on the watch and then of course we have much more information much more possibilities on the app we have the status here with all the fitness recording and heart rate 24 7 if you have activated that and the blood oxygen and the calories and sleep tracking and then we can start workout right uh, from here as well and then we have a lot of settings which we can do here for the watch we can see the connection 
and we have a lot of watch faces really nice ones here which we can install directly here from the app you can see we can load even much more really a lot of very good very beautiful watch faces with a lot of information then we can activate the activate call notification music control message notification that's really important here we can activate the notifications here from the smartphone but this is everything what we can turn on there are not more apps which we can activate for message notifications only these are possible but usually these are the most important things for for most of the people then we have auto reminder activity reminder and the alarms same thing as we already had on the watch heart rate monitoring 24 7 activate remote control photography additional device settings the weather forecast you can set for what location you want it then period and fertility tracking for female turnover to wake screen you can set that you don't want uh, to have this automatic screen on during the night it's really really helpful and then we can upgrade and get more information about the device uh, really a lot of thing I would say really comprehensive and so I would say this covers most of the needs of most of the people so I can give you a full recommendation and I'll put down the link to the Amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it and I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe to the channel thanks for watching see you next time